Our chief meteorologist, Natasha Stembach, is also a pilot. She is at the International Air Show out at Hillsboro on this gorgeous day, and she had a chance to fly with the Canadian snowbirds yeah. today. I'm, I'm kind of a little jealous. Let's go to her live now and see how things went. Did you have fun, Natasha? Oh, gosh, I had a blast. And, you know, this morning, it started off pretty early. Uh, I had the opportunity to give a weather briefing to the performers who are flying today. And, again, they'll be flying this weekend as well at the Oregon International Air Show. Gave my weather brief. Weather today, pretty easy considering it's been absolutely clear. A little bit on the toasty side, but winds haven't been too much of an issue here for us at Hillsboro Airport. Now, the Canadian Forces Snowbirds incredible demonstration team. I flew in the Tudor CT114 and my pilot, well, his call sign was Panda, but I had a chance to talk to Captain Sarah Dollair. She had a lot to say about being a part of this demonstration team. Surround yourself with the right people that will support you no matter what it is. It you can do it. Yeah, incredible. Uh, talking, excuse me, speaking with uh, Captain Sarah, she was, uh, you know, going into the details of what it's like to be a part of this demonstration team and all that it took for her to get to this point in her life. You know, she got her license when she was uh, 17 years old. I think about that here. It took me a while to get mine, but the, the message really is whatever your dream is, if it's in the air or on the ground, just go for it and start working on it right now. Of course, there's a lot going out here on here with the Oregon International Air Show. There's a lot to see, and all that information is on our uh, website. That's coin.com. And you can also check out more flying video of my flight today. Uh, that's on my Facebook page, Natasha Coin 6 Weather. And you can also check it out on Twitter. Follow me, Natasha Coin 6. We'll have more details coming up a little bit later in the 6 o'clock. Hey, quick question, Natasha. How many G's <laughs> were, your, were you pulling up there? Yeah, I mentioned this in the four o'clock. It was only three and a half. I mean, a lot of the flying that we did was like really tight formation, which was awesome. Yeah. Um, FAA rules for this particular air show said you cannot with passengers do any aerobatics. So we skipped that part, just did the tight formation. But even just doing tight formation and really banking on those turns, three and a half G's doesn't yeah. sound like a lot, but that's three and a half times your body weight pressed against you. It made me a little sick at the end. Oh, well. That's okay. So, there you go. Oh, well. That's okay. <laughs> I'm, just so, I'm just so happy you got a chance to go out there. As I said, no one would appreciate that more mm -hmm. than you being a pilot, being out there. So we're glad you got that chance today, Natasha. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah and so great. proud of her yes, to be able yes. to do that yeah. anyways. I mean, I couldn't do it. So yeah. a lot.